introducing my squash plant. So this is what happens when you go to the grocery store, you buy some squash, and then you end up tossing the seeds into the ground. It grows into some crazy big monstrous plant just like this one. So what I'm zooming into right now is called a squash blossom. These are flowers that are edible, but you do want to be careful with which ones you pick. Uh, there are female flowers and there are male flowers, so I'll show you the difference. This one is a female flower, so if you do take a close look, you can see that there are little baby squash growing. If you ever see baby squash growing on the same vine as a flower, do not pick that blossom, otherwise the squash won't mature. You want to probably stick with something like the first one that I showed you that grows towards the ends. Usually the ones that grow towards the ends are male flowers and the ones that grow towards the center are female flowers. So these ones I'm a little bit hesitant to pick because they are close to the center of the plant. So I want to see if some squash will be yielded from this one. So to prepare them, what you do is you pluck them from the plant, you remove the center fuzzy part, you wash them, make sure there are no bugs in them. Because the first time I ever had splash, ever had squash blossoms, there was actually a bee in mine. But because they're so tasty, I take the risk and I check very, very carefully every single time I have them. So one way to prepare them is to mince some garlic and fry the squash blossoms in with a little bit of extra virgin olive oil. That's all is needed because they are naturally fairly tasty. Some of the fancier people like to stuff them, batter them, and then fry them. So that gives you a whole new culinary adventure. So if you take a look, I am still videotaping this squash plant and you can probably tell by now that it's gigantic, so I am coming close to the end. And I think here is another squash blossom that's growing. Excited about that one. So there we go. If you ever see something growing in your yard like this, or if you purposely grow it, keep in mind that the squash blossoms are edible and super tasty.